We are currently in the Sevilla airport and we are off to our fourth country together, France. We're gonna take you with us on our journeys to get there. Let's go. So, the airline that we're flying with is Transavia Airlines and we are so glad that we got in line to check in early because the line is just getting longer and longer. It's time to check in. And we made it. We successfully checked in, chugged a bunch of water before getting through security, and went through security. And now we're right out here, waiting next to our gate. Let's go to Paris, baby. Woo! Oh man, what the fact. <laughs> All right. Now all there's left to do is wait. Bonjour, bienvenue, madame, monsieur. Even in line, we're starting to hear people speak French. Gentlemen, good evening, welcome about your Savia. I'm about the France Calam Group to Paris early. On effectué un comptage, nous vous demandons de vous asseoir le plus rapidement possible. Nous demandons au passage. The flight will last two hours and ten minutes. Nice weather en route at destination also. Cloudy weather for ten degrees. We wish you a pleasant flight. On effectué un comptage, nous vous demandons de vous asseoir le plus rapidement possible. Nous demandons au passage. We're in Paris. <laughs> We are officially in our fourth country. It's so confusing. People are speaking to us in French and all we can say is bonjour. <laughs> Okay, so we're in baggage claim and we were under the impression just from the fact that we're going into a new country that we would have to go through customs, but there isn't any. So maybe when you fly within the EU, you just get to go into the country. I don't know. That, this is the first time either of us have ever done this. So mm -hmm. I guess let's go to the hostel. <laughs> Okay, so currently we're trying to figure out how to get to the hostel from the airport. And there are pretty much two options that we're leaning towards. One Uber, the other public transit. And the Uber costs 45 euros and the train only costs 2 euros per person. I think we know the obvious choice here. We are on pickpocketer patrol. Marika has her backpack like a baby and she's walking behind me. <laughs> Paris is a big tourist site and at least according to what we've heard, there are a lot of pickpocketers here so we're just trying to be careful. Hello, do you want some <laughs> chips? I want some chips. I want some chocolate. Okay, let's get some. <laughs> the flavors of chips are crazy. Bro. All right, pesto mozzarella chips. How are they? Really good. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Do they taste like pesto? Uh-huh. Nice mix of nut and chocolate. We got two tickets, and boy were they expensive. Compared to what we spent for public transit in the past, 950 euros each, one way, Paris is pricey. Mm. 
and we bought tickets for the wrong bus. This is a struggle. You have no idea what you're doing, and you're just making mistakes, learning one step at a time. Feeling a little bit overwhelmed, a little bit stressed out, and a little bit frustrated. But the difference between an adventure and an ordeal is your mindset. We made it to downtown Paris. Now we're gonna take the metro, figuring it out. Sick, it's only five euros. Cool, train is done. Now we just have around a 10 minute walk to get to our hostel. I'm very eager to get there and chill for a second. We're here and we're gonna buzz in. We're waiting to get our room and they have a guitar here, so. <laughs> It is so insane to be standing in the same room as Mona Lisa, one of the most famous paintings in the world. Oh, that's me. On two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Have you seen the song from Hamilton? To learn your friend. They're closing us in. 